try and get myself up over this edge here. I've just kicked it up on the wall, give myself some space. Yeah, hey, g'day Canyoners. Welcome to another Workshop Wednesday. The last couple of weeks over on the Australian Canyoners group, we've all been practicing our ascending. Lots of people sending in videos of them ascending up to the rafters in their kitchen, their, their lounge room, uh, their sheds, trees out the back, whatever. Ascending up, switching over to descent and, and heading back down. It's been really good to see. Generated a lot of discussion on tips, techniques, and all that sort of thing. I think we all got something out of it. But as someone rightly pointed out, we're missing out on the hardest bit going over the top or going over a ledge from an overhanging stance. So I thought I'd come out, uh, get out of the shed, come up to the backyard and um, just uh, see what we can do. Couldn't find too many videos on uh, YouTube or anything like that explaining how to do it. So um, give you a couple of little tips what I tend to do. This one is a pretty easy little ledge to go over because I've got a, a foothold um, just under me. If that's not the case we might have to do something a little bit more drastic, but pretending that I haven't got my foothold here. I'm coming up to the top. I'm gonna to get my foot as high as I can and then work my way up. Now at this stage, getting that to go past the ledge is really difficult. If I can just get a little purchase on the rock there, I might be able to just push out and up just enough to get that over. Um, if I can't do that, there's a couple of other things I can do. Um, I can actually just grab the rope up here and mantle up as I was, I was rock climbing. I try and get uh, my foot loop as high as possible. I might even shorten that up, get my foot right up, reach up and just mantle up. A little bit of risk because if you fall, it's gonna be a static fall. So the other thing I can do going to pull up a safety knot here I'm just gonna tie that in here I'm gonna take my footer center off and see if I can find somewhere up here where I can just put that back on the rope Move myself right up. So the reason I put the, the knot on was just so I'm not hanging off one point of contact. So now my foot ascent is nice and, and high. I can stand up into that loop and then my weight's not on this bit. So as I pull myself up, I should be able to move over the top of the loop, over the top of the edge, get myself as high as I can, sit back down into it, move my foot up a little bit further and just continue on up and then I've scaled the ledge. And uh, yeah, that's probably how I'd get over a ledge like that. Hopefully you got something out of that, continue practicing. The more people are uploading videos on this type of stuff, even if it's not ascending, it's some other sort of technique, generates discussion, it's really, really good. I've been loving it the last couple of weeks. so. Hope to catch you out there, stay safe and catch you later.